district administration district administration states in india are divided into districts the districts are further divided into blocks or tehsils or talukas district administration means management of affairs within a district district collector the district falls under the charge of a district officer called deputy commissioner or district collector district collector is appointed by the state government and acts as the representative of the state government functions of district collector maintenance of law and order maintenance of land records and land acquisition collection of land revenues disaster management during natural calamities such as droughts famines floods or epidemics civic amenities and public services to control black marketing and ensure equitable distribution of essential and controlled commodities supervision of panchayati raj supervision of police and jails police to maintain law and order in the district the collector is assisted by superintendent of police the highest police officer in the district deputy superintendent of police inspectors and sub inspectors station house officer sho in charge of a police station police constables hundreds of police constables work under the sho and carry out his orders reporting a crime a written complaint of a crime such as theft fight injury or accident lodged with the officer in charge of the police station is known as fir or first information report the police can take action and start the investigation process only after the fir is registered maintenance of land records land disputes in a village are settled by the sarpanch of the village with the help of land record officer called patwari 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 is also known as lekhpal or kanun go His chief duties includes to maintain and update the record as to who would inherit the land to keep an account of the collection of revenue from the farmers to maintain record of the crops grown at every harvest tehsildar the tehsildars are tax inspectors they are in charge of collecting revenue or tax from a tehsil they monitor the work of the patwari judicial administration at the district level there are two types of courts which are concerned with administration of day to day and long range activities of the court system civil courts civil cases or the cases related to money or property matters are decided in the civil courts criminal courts cases related to crimes 
such as murders theft threat to life or property are decided in the criminal courts the criminal courts are presided by a session judge the court of session judge is the highest court in a district